literally every single one of these recon guys, they all say the same thing. The hardest and most dangerous missions were their search and rescue missions. And they called them bright light missions. There's a 12-man recon team that had been surrounded. The NVA force that they're engaged with is a battalion strength, so a thousand guys. Okay. These guys need a bright light team. Back on the FOB, Roy Benavidez volunteers and jumps on the helo. He says, I'll be a one-man bright light. And he does so so quickly that the only thing he actually grabs is his knife and a med bag. He doesn't even take an M16 or an M4. So he's got no firearm. In this six-hour fight, he is responsible for saving the lives of at least eight guys, but he also has 37 separate wounds from bullets, shrapnel, and knives or bayonets. Everybody thinks he's so dead, they already have him in a body bag. And when the doctor is going to zip up the body bag, the only thing Roy Benavidez can do is spit in the doctor's face. Before the bag gets zipped up. Mm -hmm. You got goosebumps from that, man. 